I really believe in, uh, and this is something that I would really want to share with you guys because um, I went to school as, as, as you guys came here and a lot of people actually go to school and they invest all this uh, time and money or whatever you want to invest in the school. Uh, in, and then you just walk out of the school and, and all this dream, if you have any, you just disappear after you kind of get out of the school. In my, in my way, actually, in my, in my um, experience, it was all the opposite. I mean, I had a lot of time myself to practice, and I put a lot of time when I was at the school, but when I get out of it, I say, now is the time for me to make my own school. I believe a lot of who's learning more than who's teaching. And this is very important because we have, you know, 30 people in the class, maybe 10 people are getting really the point of what the professor is, is trying to tell you. And maybe 20, they are not interested. And they don't, you know, you learn a lot from, even from things that you don't want it to do. It's, it's good to hear a professor that you don't want to follow too. It's a good thing. Because you're the one that is learning what you want to do or not. That's very important. You know, the professor doesn't mean that you have to do whatever the professor has, you know, is telling you to do at this moment. Okay, I do it and, and whatever it is. But after you finish the school, then you're on your own. You have to learn what you want to do or what you don't want to do, even from this, uh, you know, situation. So that's what I did. I, I went, you know, after, after the school finished and the whole thing, I just say, I just have to do this on my own, start you know, practicing myself and getting as much information as possible, reading and doing a lot of uh, homework to be able to, when these circumstances, like the Lincoln Center, present me the opportunity and commission me to write a piece for the Big Bang. Uh, that was for me a, a quite a, a, an experience because I actually did this, uh, uh, this Big Bang piece in a month all by uh, handwritten. And I kind of became a crazy guy in the living room of my house with a piano and a big table with all these pages running around. And uh, that's what I did for, you know, for a whole month. And it took me, you know, I learned through this experience that I had to actually get into, into doing, writing the music on the computer so I can paste and do things like that. It's easier and more uh, effective. You know, so I mean, this is a lot of uh, things to talk, but this is just one thing that I want to mention. It's not only because some sometimes people say, "Well, I didn't learn that in school, so why would you do?" You know, that kind of thing. And uh, it's not about what the teacher gives you; it's what you really want to learn. What What are you really looking for here? Is the dream that you had at home before to come here to this school? It was to become you know, a musician or a music, a music business, uh, uh, you know, representative or whatever you want to call it, you know. That's, that's what is going to keep you all the way through your real career. This is not your career. This is a preparation for you. This is, you know, 10 years from now, who you knows what's going to happen. It, it depends really on, on your will, on what you have inside. That's uh, obviously great advice. Tell me about, um, when did you come to this country?